This report briefly outlines the major achievements of the Democratic Progressive Party government over the past five years, the DPP. This is a report of a nation that is moving forward with hope and confidence. When His Excellency Nwazi Professor Bingo Wamtalika was democratically elected to be President of the Republic of Malawi in 2004, the people of this country were looking for a leader that could cure the chronic socio-economic malice that categorized the government of Malawi under the UDF government. They were looking for a leader that would bring in policies that would transform the country to an economically progressive nation as well as food secure. There is a general consensus that His Excellency Ngwazi Professor Bingo Amtalika has brought hope to the people of Malawi. From day one of his leadership, he has emphasized that Malawi is not a poor country. He called upon the people to realize that Malawi is richly endowed and numerous natural and human resources are available that can turn the country into a wealthy nation. His Excellency Wazi Professor Bing Omtalika also stated that there is need for change in the mindset and a greater commitment and being more patriotic and that it is indeed possible to turn around the economy and put the country on the road to prosperity if the country remained united. Within five years, he delivered on his promises. The DPP government delivered on every promise it made. Malawi has emerged from begging for food to a food self-sufficient and developed country. Today, it even exports foods and donates foods to faraway countries as far as Haiti. Modern infrastructure continue to flourish throughout the country. People have witnessed the social and economic transformation and have trust and confidence that indeed this government is the government of the people. Above all, the people of Malawi are now proud to be Malawians. Malawians today are proud that they have a leadership with a clear vision. The people of Malawi know where they come from, where they are going. And as a nation, we remain optimistic and are firm on track to the road to prosperity. Malawi has made phenomenal progress during the period 2004 to 2011. We have transformed our country from food deficit to a food surplus country. We have reduced the number of people below the poverty line. We have achieved the rate of economic growth averaging 7.5% annually. We have reduced both maternal and infant mortality. We have successfully brought the HIV AIDS pandemic under control. And there are nearly 400,000 people receiving free ARVs. We have constructed more roads, schools, hospitals, and clinics to improve the quality of life. And we have promoted more women to high decision-making positions. Malawi is therefore truly a success story as a result of the wise and dynamic leadership of His Excellency Professor Ngwazi, Dr. Bingo Amtalika. In order to achieve these great achievements, we had to have our shared vision. And our shared vision has been to see our country resume economic growth fast enough to bring about prosperity, to reduce poverty significantly, and to make life better for everyone, and to see that our country transforms from being a predominantly importing and consuming country to predominantly producing for exports and to gradually emerge as an industrial nation capable of transforming our agriculture primary commodities other raw materials and minerals so as to create wealth for our people malawians we have all agreed that our common mission is to instill confidence in the economy and to persuade malawians to believe in ourselves that we can achieve microeconomic growth and reduce poverty through sound financial management and fiscal prudence. As Malawians, we realize that we need to create more jobs and redistribute income by promoting significant domestic savings, foreign financing and investment in our agriculture, processing, industrial production and manufacture, thereby increasing the supply of goods and services for the domestic and international market. The leadership and people of Malawi are determined to collectively unite the people of Malawi. 
regardless of tribe, race, color, religion, or creed, political affiliation, so that together we can build the kind of nation we want for ourselves, our children, and our grandchildren, to provide sound political and economic leadership, and to work with all Malawians, including those in opposition, in a spirit of political tolerance, understanding, and reconciliation, and to consolidate peace, harmony, security, and stability as the basis for prosperity of our country. Today, throughout the world, Malawi is regarded as one of the most peaceful nations based on our collective pledge, our common mission, and most of all, our shared vision as a nation of our chiefs. The DPP government has promised and has delivered. It has its programs which have brought irrigation on track. We have brought education on track. We have brought food security on track. Economic empowerment is on track. Religious tolerance is throughout the country. And our road infrastructure is on track. Our health care are on track. Women empowerment is on track. And our agriculture is on track. The DPP has more than delivered. And Malawi is truly a country that can be proud and is now regarded as a nation of achievers throughout the world. When did Professor Bingu Wamutarika become president and how was 2009 elections won? His Excellency Professor Bingu Mutarika was elected first on the 24th of May 2004. The DPP government contested again in 2009 and on the 21st of May we were elected with a landslide victory of over 2.9 million votes. The results were a true testimony of the great achievements and the road to prosperity that Malawi had embarked on. The nation had come out in extremely large numbers. Over 78% of the voter turnout came out to guarantee that the DPP-led government would continue the road to prosperity with a fresh mandate of five years up to 2014. The whole nation was united. In the north of the country, out of 686,000 votes cast, His Excellency Professor Bingham Talika got over 650,000 of those votes. In the southern region, over 1.9 million votes were cast. His Excellency got over 1.4 million of those votes. In securing the last region of the country, the central region, the DPP-led government, under His Excellency Professor Bingo Amtalika, managed to secure 931,000 of the votes, showing a clear testimony that the country was solid and united in bringing in the DPP. The vote pattern throughout the nation was uniform and recognized the development of Malawi. This indeed was a seal of approval to show that all quarters of the nation had benefited on the road to prosperity. All areas of the country had transformed and the citizens of this country were throwing their vote as testimony of the appreciation of the government that was under His Excellency Professor Bingham Talika. This was indeed critical and important and an important ingredient for the country to continue the road to prosperity. But more importantly, it was a vote of confidence of the government that had transformed the country and had changed it and brought about food security. This was the beginning of our road to prosperity from 2004 to 2011. 